of all, I'd like to welcome all of you to the Trout Gallery in the new home of the uh, Trout Gallery Outreach Program. I actually can't believe this is actually happening. <laughs> it's like, this is a very big moment for the outreach program. We've been in existence for more than 20 years, and the program has steadily grown to really huge proportions. And we uh, alluded to some of the challenges that we face in delivering the kinds of programs that we like to deliver without an education room up to this point. Um, so really, the facility is very much needed. It's truly a wonderful gift to Dickinson College and the broader community. I promise you, the Muppert Stewart Education Center is going to be a happening place. There will literally be thousands of area school children, even just this year, school teachers, adults from adult community groups, and Dickinson College students using this room every year. Um, they'll be actively engaged in noisy group projects, creative processes that make use of things like tables, chairs, sinks, <laughs> space, things that we've never actually had before. So that's pretty, um, pretty phenomenal for us to actually have that kind of facility available to us. The kinds of activities that will go on in this room are uh, art projects, of course, group projects that involve building large structures, drama projects, experiments, demonstrations of art processes, um, exhibitions of student artwork critiques. We even have the capability of showing slideshows, films. I mean, it's really going to be a wonderful multi-purpose room. I'm really, really excited to have so many possibilities now for the types of activities that we can offer with our programs. It's also going to serve as a bustling workshop for our Dickinson College or interns in museum education. This year we have five students working with the outreach program. Our Dickinson College students, I'll be introducing to them to you shortly. Um, we're also very fortunate to have some of our previous interns that have worked with the, with the gallery programs um, visiting us today. They came up from Washington, D.C. and various places where they live to come back to be here for the um, dedication of this room because they fully understand, having worked with this program for several years, what it means to us to actually have a classroom. Uh, the outreach program was conceived of 20 years ago as a means by which Dickinson College could share its cultural and educational resources with a broader community. And over the years, the scope of our program and the, the actual size of our audience has very, very steadily grown. This fall marks my 10th year with the outreach program, so it's kind of a nice gift for me, 10th anniversary. And I did a little math and calculated that during the past 10 years, I have personally worked with 30,000 <laughs> visitors in outreach programs at the college. So that just gives you an indication of the kind of volume of, of participation we have with these programs. And given the population of Carlisle is really not very large and we live in a, you know, a semi-rural area, and we were making a significant impact um, on the community. When we're doing those kinds of numbers, that means, and especially 20 years, that means that we are now populating Carlisle and surrounding areas with people who had museum experiences as a regular part of their childhood. That wasn't true before the Fowler Gallery program existed.